Work is stressful enough without dealing with traffic to get there. To make my commute a 95 easier, I carpool with coworkers from Prince William County up to Washington, D.C. On days I can't carpool, I slug. I love my faster trip in the HOV lanes, but a few things really bug me about my commute. For starters, I often see people driving in the HOV lanes by themselves and cheating the system. And sometimes I'll leave work early to avoid the rush when the HOV lanes open, but then I end up sitting in traffic in Dumfries where the HOV lanes end. Relief is on the way with the 95 Express Lanes. The new Express Lanes will help improve travel, extend HOV benefits to Stafford County, add new entry and exit points, and alleviate congestion at the Dumfries bottleneck. Carpoolers with at least three people in the vehicle, including the driver, will travel toll-free on the 95 Express Lanes and will benefit from the expanded commuter lots throughout the I-95 corridor. Drivers traveling alone or with one passenger will be able to pay a toll to access the lanes at any time. The 95 Express Lanes begin in the Edsel Road area on I-395 in Fairfax County and extend to Garrisonville Road on I-95 in Stafford County. You can enter and exit from major roads including the Prince William Parkway, Route 123, Route 1, and the Franconia Springfield Parkway, or from the regular lanes on I-95. The 95 Express Lanes provide a seamless connection to the 495 Express Lanes, meaning you can take a predictable, congestion-free trip for more than 40 miles from Stafford County to Tyson's Corner. Sluggers, vanpoolers, and carpoolers can travel on the 95 Express Lanes toll-free at any time with an Easy Pass Flex and three or more people, including the driver, in the vehicle. An Easy Pass Flex has a switch that allows you to change between toll-free HOV mode and toll-paying mode. When your carpool is ready, switch your flex to HOV mode. You'll know your flex is in HOV mode if you hear a beep. If you're traveling alone or with just one passenger, make sure your flex is in toll paying mode. The express lanes will be reversible like today's HOV lanes, but the rules of the road will be in effect 24 seven, not just during peak travel times. Standard HOV rules will apply on the I-395 HOV lanes. When traveling northbound in the morning, vehicles that do not meet the HOV requirement when the HOV rules are in effect will need to exit from the express lanes and re-enter the regular I-395 lanes. Carpoolers heading north on the express lanes will be able to continue onto the I-395 HOV lanes. Traveling southbound in the afternoon, the HOV lanes end and the express lanes begin on I-395 south near Edsel Road. All travelers will need an Easy Pass or Easy Pass Flex to enter the express lanes. Vehicles that do not have an Easy Pass or don't want to travel on the express lanes can exit the I-395 HOV lanes and re-enter the regular lanes. Carpoolers can continue onto the express lanes and travel toll-free with an Easy Pass Flex set to HOV mode. The 95 express lanes mean predictable travel times for more than 40 miles of express lanes on 95 and 495. And for carpoolers like me, toll-free travel, 24 hours a day, 7 days a week. Get your Easy Pass Flex, and I'll see you on the express lanes.